All right, lovelies, what you're going to need is a brush, um, Echo Styler Gel, any kind you use or whatever kind of gel you use, uh, some water, and in my water I have a little bit of coconut oil, um, what else I have in here? A lot of little oils in my water, just a little bit, but some simple water, and I'm going to be using some leave-in conditioner by Cantu Shea Butter. Now I had my style in um, yesterday, so it's already sectioned and off. Already sectioned off, but um, just in some twists. What you want to do is take your hair and divide it into two sections. And the two sections that I have are right here in my crown area. Just want to go right there. Oh, you're also going to need a hair tie. So that first section, you just want to separate it. Take it a loose. And what I do is spray around my edges, get that a little moist. Then I'll go in with some Echo Styler Gel. You don't need a lot. Whatever you're comfortable with. Slip my edges up and the back. Take my brush. Slip up the sides and the back. into a high ponytail take my hair bow tie it into a ponytail and then what I like to do, just I put the Cantu Shea Butter on the ends of my hair just to keep them moisturized. Even though they're tucked away, I just like to put something on them every day so my ends don't get all dried out and nasty and start breaking off. So next, what you want to do is, let me get this out of the way. Just take it. Um... Take your hair, pull it back, get you some bobby pins, take it and tuck it under and just secure it. Secure it just like that. You can make yours as big or as small as you want. You play around with it till you get it how you like it. And then I take my front part, do the same thing, get you some um, whatever moisturizer. I mean, this is not necessary, but I do it. Get whatever moisturizer you like to use. Put on the ends. And you can do a simple, just a simple high hump like this. Take your bobby pins, pin it. 
I mean, you could just play around with the front and get it how you like it. But I kind of like the little asymmetrical hump in the front. So how I get that, I just take the side, start on one side, kind of twist it backwards, twist it, twist it on the side. Take this, the ends of it, twist it all the way back right in front of your hump. I don't know if you can see that. Get a bobby pin and secure that. And like before, you just play around with it until you get it how you like it. You can make it as tall or as short as you want it. But this is a real simple do. Shouldn't take no longer than five minutes. And there you go. That's it. Quick, simple, cute, little jazzy updo. Alright guys, I'll see you later. Bye.